Yo, what up, ladies and gentlemen? Mr. Gross here, back from MBR Starcast, with some Wild Star gameplay for you guys today. And we're looking at one of the world bosses that you currently find around. I think it's around about the level 10 area. The world boss was actually level 10. He's called Metalmore. I'm not actually sure what this area is called. It's on the Dominion side, and I believe it was around an area called the Bloodfire. I was I had my mate around my house, and I've uh, currently got Wild Star. I haven't actually purchased it. My mate did, and we, he got a free trial, and there's a couple of us playing it. Given it a go, so I played it in the beat up to level 3, which was probably the worst thing I could do, because that's just a boring part, and it's too tutorial, and you don't see anything. Once you get past level 3, which is where I stopped, is once you start actually getting into the combat and stuff, and it's really quite it's quite good, you know, I'm, I'm enjoying it. The PvP is really fun. I'll probably be making some PvP videos in the future. To the case whether I'll buy it or not, I'm not I'm sure. I'm kind of, you know, I'm not enjoying the quest inside too much. I think it's, there's so many tasks everywhere and it's very kind of confusing what you have to do. But anyway, I was strolling along, me and my mate, just doing some quests. And I saw this dude and I walked over there and we were admiring how, like, crazy he looked. and. I was like, wow, and there was just no one, was, no one was fighting him. I was like, you know, dare I challenge to fight him? And obviously, you can see how long this goes on for this video. It goes for about 20 minutes of me and everyone else that eventually joined in. But there was a level 18 come over. I like, say this is level 10 world boss, and a level 18 come over and started soloing it. And I, I was joining in with him. You can see the level 18 currently on the screen now. And uh, I joined in with him, and we were getting nowhere. And eventually, over the space of like five minutes, there a load of people come, and that's when I actually started recording this video. My friend was like, oh man, you need to record this, and I. Thought, and it's, it's pretty cool, so if you guys are interested in Wildstar and haven't actually seen a world boss yet, this is the first time I, have, I actually saw one, it was just a coincidence that I stumbled across it, and luckily we had all these people join, and I got invited to some group, and we were just, you know, messing them up. It took a very long time, as you can see throughout this video, how long it takes to kill them. So, yeah, Wildstar is a really good game, if you guys are interested in it, I'm currently playing the class, which is called, uh, I can't remember what he's called, he's like the rogue, basically, of what, well, you're just a stealthy dude who does... You do a reasonable amount of damage, you know, you come behind people and you do your dash attack, your sort of shadow claws and everything, you can stun them up and whatnot. I've also been really enjoying the engineer. The engineer is good fun, you can like you have like you can turn into this robot and do more damage and he's a big tank. Well but this dude's really fun because he's really quick and good for PvP because you can go stealth and whatnot. But yeah, really epic world boss. If you guys are interested in it, I'd recommend checking out Titanfall. I think you can, the only way you really can get hold of that is actually by buying it, which uh, is probably around £30 or something, I guess. You can get the just the digital plane copy, and, which is just a reasonable amount of pay for it, but it depends. The thing with MMO is you have to put a lot of time into it, and that's what I'm not sure if I can dedicate to my time. And I really would probably only be doing the PvP, because I'm not... The PvE, but like this world boss is really cool, but there wasn't much, you know, PvE... The question system's just so long, but the combat the combat's what makes this game amazing. You can see all the triple kills, the super kills you get and stuff. It's just so much more going on, and the way you have to dodge moves, and you see all the moves and whatnot. But anyway, this was just a little short introduction of me from what the video is. I'm going to leave now, and you guys can, if you wish, you can watch the next 20 minutes, skip for it, see what you think, get an idea of... Obviously, pretty much just the same thing as this happening for the next 20 minutes, me just trying to smash this dude up. And a, com a couple of times, I kind of just run away because... I'm going to give you guys the best kind of look at them. The graphics are pretty nice what it is. The, the thing at the end of the day, a lot of people are going to compare it to WoW, because I think some of the critters from the original WoW were vanilla. I was never really... Old. I only recently got into WoW probably last year. But, um... That's from what I understand anyway, so they've kind of t probably taken everything from WoW and just improved it, and that's what it kind of does feel like. The only downside so far we've had is kind of the questing system, just where there's just so many quests, but maybe that's because I'm not used to the game, you kind of got to get your head around it. But, nevertheless, good fun game, recommend checking it out, and hope you guys enjoy the rest of this world boss, old Melmore, just take his flipping time to die. But yeah, GG, peace.